four rooms, earth view. Sounds far-fetched at the moment, doesn't it? But you know, we may be seeing ads like this in the not-too-distant future. In fact, there's the equivalent of a small bungalow out there in space right now that's empty and available with a beautiful view of Earth. Skylab, a bungalow that has already had nine tenants. The main purpose of Skylab was to make space flight more useful for man's endeavors on Earth. As NASA Administrator James C. Fletcher put it, Skylab marked the transition from exploration to the exploitation of space. As has been said, the average taxpayer is entitled to ask, what's in space for me? Well, the results from Skylab will, we hope, answer that. Let's take a look now at the development of the Skylab space station itself. As I said before, this was really an economical venture to which the earlier major space programs contributed greatly, enabling the Skylab project to use flight hardware already in existence. It's 48 feet tall and 22 feet across with a 13,000 cubic foot interior. 10,000 cubic feet of working space in the main section alone, the equivalent of a small family bungalow. Skylab is divided into a lower floor with crew quarters, wardroom, and medical experiment area, with an upper floor for space technology equipment. The multiple docking adapter provides docking ports for the command module, as well as housing the control console for the solar telescopes, and a series of cameras for conducting Earth resources observations.